Welcome Zamora Gaming fans, I'm your host Joe Zamora here, and I am bringing you week four of the Terminus Challenger League. Um, again, like week three, uh, week four, I wasn't able to record live, so I am going to be doing a post-com of the battle. So let's jump in and see how this goes. This week we did play Fish Brat. He had a very scary team. Um, Electivire is a Pokemon I love, but hate to fight. Hitmonlee, I... For some reason thought uh unburden uh fake out normal gym was a thing but obviously normal gym wasn't until after gen 5 so i was afraid of that this whole battle for no reason and um i knew crowbat was his biggest monster and i wanted to get rid of that as soon as possible so let's see if we were able to do that all right so the char tree it sent out fella preferred and um, Fish Brat sends out the Needle Queen. And I got the rain up. Unexpected by Thunder. I was going to U-turn out. Um, did not want to hard switch into Kingdra. But, uh, <laughs> I mean, at least we got our rain up, right? So he switches out into Blastoise. And I get my focus energy up because I want a critical hit thing. And um, I get a Hydro Pump off on Blastoise. Do 50%. He goes for Shell Smash. But um, I made sure we had enough health under, I mean, enough speed under rain that we would outspeed. And I go for the Draco Meteor. We got a critical hit, too. I don't know if that mattered, but we took that thing out. So now he brings in Breloom, which is a monster in itself. Uh, this is where I send in Nido King just to get smacked by Breloom. Uh, Breloom is Choice Scar. I mean, Choice Banded. I found that out after the battle. Um, so we were able to switch right back into Kingdra and Crobat, and we are faster. So we get the Hydro Pump kill off on it thanks to the rain. And then let's see what he goes to here next. So Kingdra actually finally got to show off the power of a uh, round one Pokemon. Uh, Hitmonlee, I didn't want to give it free setup so i went straight for the hit draco meteor does great damage but not enough i go swallow here uh him on lee was also choice handed by the way he goes needle queen uh i go facade did not get enough damage but now thanks to guts facade boost needle queen goes down and Let's see what he goes to here. Electivire. I figured it was Scarf. So I switched. But he made the pro play. Went for Ice Punch. And took down <laughs> Nido King, Which was a great play. Uh, so I went Shuffle. Thinking this is the only thing that can really answer to it right now. And I didn't want uh, Galay taking unnecessary damage. Because he was my win con at this point. Uh, I go Sticky Webs to uh, outspeed any Scarfers or anything like that. I go for Stealth Rocks to get residual damage. And of course, you know what Bartender does. He, he ain't going to be the life of the party, but he's going to keep it going, you know? Uh, Wild Charge comes off. I Power Split, so um, Electivire doesn't hit as hard. So the Pokemon I get in can uh, set up rather well. I go for Final Gambit, because I, I really I didn't want to give him the kill. And I thought it would do a little bit more than that. But, you know, it goes based off HP, so it wasn't going to do great. Electivire goes down to Kamikaze. So we were faster than it regardless. It, it turned out not to be Scarf is what I meant to say. And I was afraid of Fake Out for some reason, but he didn't get it. So Bullet Punch hits me. Uh, Facade takes Hitmonlee down. And here I was like, oh yeah, Swellow gets the sweep. Easy kill. And Breloom... Being a technician choice banded comes at me with a mock punch. I'm just like, oh, fuck. Did I throw? <laughs> like, can I win? And I was like, mock punch shouldn't be able to kill, right? Uh, mock punch does almost half, though. We do psycho cut with a critical hit, surprisingly, and take down the balloon. Didn't need the critical hit, but we did it there. And uh, that was our week four battle, putting us at two and two. 
um if you are excited about uh this league i would suggest keep watching uh a lot of people in this league are very competitive and the records show like no one's like way up there i believe except for one person and we faced him week one so luckily we don't have to deal with that again so playoffs if we make it and i do expect to make playoffs so thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys next time